Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at Index Press from Michelle and Verne Magic. What is this? This is a pocket index. It's a pocket index system. Uh, it's a utility, okay, it's a gimmick that is used by mentalists typically for prediction effects okay and it's actually an old school uh utility okay it's been around for a while this isn't something that michelle necessarily invented um, his creation is actually uh, a composition of something that animan originally came up with in the jinx back in 1940 and it also has a little bit of patrick page uh, he had something called the q5 so it's kind of like those two things married together but really the bulk of this product is the trick that you are getting with this okay so this is all centered around the invisible deck routine that michelle is going to teach you and really in this routine you're doing the invisible deck routine without an actual deck <laughs> all right because that would make the most sense right if you're doing an invisible deck routine there should never be an actual deck of cards so you can walk up to a spectator anybody you want and you say hey Think of any card in the deck. There's absolutely no force, no fishing, no questions asked. Um, they think of a card uh, and then you proceed to say, you know, hey, I was, in a, I was at a coffee shop and I was just thinking about, you know, meeting you today and I just had this weird uh, premonition when I was drinking my coffee and uh, I, just, I just grabbed a pen really fast and I wrote down something on the inside of my sugar packet. And then you say, what was the name of your card? He says, six of clubs. You reach into your pocket and pull out your sugar packet from the day you open it up and they're written on the inside of the sugar packet is the six of clubs reveal sound pretty cool let's get into this review all right so a couple questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews and the first of which is what is in the box what's in the box you're getting a tiny plastic envelopey thing okay uh, you're gonna get your two gimmicks inside of that you're also gonna get access out to the internet internet's gonna give you a 26 minute instructional DVD and you're also gonna get a three page PDF is it what I thought it, it's absolutely what I thought because they show you what it is on the product page so there's no there's no hidden anything and I can show you the gimmicks I can show you what they look like uh, pocket indexes are not a big secret people know what pocket indexes look like so this is not a reveal this is not giving anything away if you head on down to your favorite magic store uh, uh, you're gonna see these pictures as well so there's no hidden surprises there as far as the angles go how are the angles uh, all of this fits in your pocket okay so these all fit in your pocket no one's ever gonna see them okay they're never they're never seen so nobody ever says, well, let me inspect your pants, <laughs> right? I hope nobody ever says, let me inspect your pants. Um, that said, that said, you are still fumbling around in your pocket for a time. So this is how are the angles is gonna marry along with uh, practice, okay? So as far as practice goes and the angles go, you know what, you've gotta be fast. You have got to be fast. So you're digging into a pocket and you're pulling out one packet, right? One sugar packet that has the reveal for a card, which means you have 52 in there, right? There's because there's one for every single card. So that means you have to be able to count. You have to be count fast, find fast, and be confident that you are pulling out the right one every single time. So you got to look like you're not doing what you're doing. You means you have to go down in your pocket, quickly find the thing you want and pull it back out lightning fast and so practice wise this is going to be something that you're going to have to have like in your pocket and just randomly ask your mom or dad or somebody walking down the street hey name a card six of clubs boom practice pull it out don't do the whole routine just practice finding that card and pulling it out the faster you are and the more precise you are the better you are all right so what's the overall quality and production value of the video uh in the video uh michelle is teaching you against a red curtain backdrop there's also a teenager there there's this kid there uh who's kind of helping him out michelle uh english is not his first language and so the teenager the kid kind of helps him along uh, get his words out and uh, reminds him kind of like what the next thing to say is 
is or uh, reminds him of, about the next part of the trick or the next thing they want to talk about. They're both microphoned. You can see a microphone on both of them. However, the kid is like perfectly crystal clear and Michelle is echoey and distant sounding. So it almost sounds like they put the mic on him, but they didn't turn it on, which is fine. It doesn't take away from any of the teaching or anything. You can totally still hear him. Uh, and then there's Spanish subtitles underneath. Most of it is a distance shot. You're going to get a couple of close ups. As far as what's taught on the video, like I said, they're both there as your instructors. They're both there to teach you. Um, they're going to teach you the invisible deck trick. Obviously, they're going to teach you that trick. That is the bulk of what you're getting. You're getting that trick with the materials to help you do it. The only thing you're not getting is all the sugar packets. So you're gonna have to go out and find 52 sugar packets, rip them open, and then hand write every single card reveal. So that's part of your setup. So as far as setup and reset, this is your setup. You're gonna have to do that. So you have to do all the sugar packet prep. Say that fast, sugar packet prep, sugar packet prep. They're gonna show you how to find a few example cards, okay? So they'll call out random cards and then show you briefly how you'd find them. And they even do a cool thing where they stick the pocket index in a plastic bag to simulate a pocket so that you can see the person's hand going into the plastic bag and pulling out the billets that you need. Because that's really what you're doing. You're doing a billet trick, right? You're doing a billet trick. They're gonna show you some billet switches. So how to switch one prediction for the other uh, in case you had a billet that was in view the whole time. You know, you could have a sugar packet on the table and say, that's the one, and then do a switch at the end, which would be even a bigger kicker because that would show that the prediction was in play the entire time. They're gonna talk a little bit about the history of the index, the, the history of actually where it came from and how it was invented. And they will also have that in the PDF as well. And I would just say, if you want more tricks like this, more tricks with the index or more tricks with billets and billet switching, I would highly recommend you check out the works of Animan, Tarbell, and TA Waters. All right, so is the index well made? Um, it's very well made. Uh, it's very ultra thin. It's made of really strong material. It's, uh, like I said, redesigned from these two other gimmicks. Uh, it's precision made. I think it's perfect. We talked a little bit already about set up. Reset though, of course, we'll just be putting the billet back in its little slot and you're good to go. Positives, all right, so what are the positives? What can I say about Index Press from Michelle and Verne Magic? Uh, finally, finally you can do the invisible deck routine <laughs> without a deck of cards. <laughs> Any card named is the card you reveal. No force, wow. Negatives, all right, so what are the negatives? You know, like we say around here, there's negatives to everything. These are just the negatives that I see. They don't have to be the negatives that you see. Uh, I would have liked a little bit of a longer video. 26 minutes is a little on the short end. Uh, you're paying 50 bucks for this effect. So is it worth your money? Uh, it's 50 bucks. So uh, just a couple of other tricks, a couple of the trick ideas would be helpful. I know it's difficult when so much has been published and printed with the index. I mean, who knows if you end up stealing somebody else's work, but maybe just a couple of more effects, I think for the money, a longer video would have helped, uh, I think. But I think as far as is it worth your money, I mean, if you're a mentalist and you don't have one yet, you need one of these, this is a must have. Who would like this mentalist, especially mentalists that do walk around? You stick two of these in your pocket and you're always ready to do a magic trick. All right, so that's pretty much everything I can say about Index Press from Michelle and Verne Magic. Of course, I wanna thank Murphy's Magic Supplies for allowing me to have this so that I can do the review for you. And if you would like to purchase it for yourself, you can find it at your very favorite Murphy's Magic dealer. Thanks, bye.